What are you trying to say right now? She's a like, no, no, stop! Shut up! Because he's looking at me! What are you saying right now? That we have to respect her like it's you, and you just met her. Exactly! Shut up! Ada in this lingerie, she looking like I need to go take her home, put it in the oven, heat up on 350. Jada's dope. She's dope. Come on, let's go to the bedroom. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. So you ain't, you ain't. You ain't no, no, no. Oh, baby. <laughs> I'm so mad at you. Ah, uh, Donna, 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 Donna. No, we haven't taken it there. No, nah. But, you know, tonight could be the night. on top of Jada. Yeah, did you see what her hands were doing? Don't she have a boyfriend? Oh my gosh. Why can't Donna keep her hands out of trouble? The <laughs> whole movie wow. all broken. <laughs> Yo. What's good? What up, what up? But you should have locked the door. <laughs> Wait, what is going on? What just happened? Right. What happened? What are y'all talking about? What the f happened? Anyways, <laughs> these whores are. Wait, what? Wait, 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 wait. wait. Yo, what the? They making it like a real big deal. Yeah, it's we not nothing. Y'all don't look like y'all was just talking. Look. It's not even like that. You could have just let somebody know. Ain't nobody trying to like intervene on that. But you're not about to have me out here looking like no mother <laughs> something either. Listen, man, now you trying to make me look like a mother fool, and that's not right. I think you need to really sit down, baby girl, because you doing a little bit too much. We was just around. It wasn't even serious. You know what? I don't even got nothing else to say to you right now. Come on, boy, don't be like that. Man, out of here, Jada. Whatever, man. Attention, please. The time is now. What you've been waiting for. <laughs> for my juice box to be filled with a straw of love and procreation. Elliot! Elliot! One second, guys. What is he? What is <laughs> Give me a second. Elliot! Oh, yeah, right there, right there. Elliot! Oh. What are y'all doing? No. What are y'all doing? No. What the no. f Oh my god, what the f is your f and Kevin's no. What are y'all doing? No. What are y'all doing? No. have been performing fellatio on this tall, slanky-ass Elliot. That's the cream of the crop that you're right there. That's my future kids in your head. Hello! Hey, move, move, move. They ready to die, kids! Hey, hey, hey. We... No! Oh. He's taking my You sperm burglar, you nasty mother So that's what you choose to do? Now my insemination is ruined. No. I'm trusting you. No, and no, everybody, no, no, no. Everybody out of here. You, you're fired. And you're fired out of my life and out of my universe. You, fire, you can't fire me. What are you talking I'm about? The, what the f that guy here, mother You're not. I'm the mother no, no. Alpha, Omega, and everything. 
between you're not gonna, you're not gonna either. You're that's what I'm saying about it. Like, you nah. Have fun. You're out of here. I want to come here. No, 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 no. What are you talking about? Sky, 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 sky. I hate everyone. Oh, you mother. Ladies and gentlemen, give it up for the newlyweds, Nikki and Richard Duncan. Yeah. San Francisco, Nikki's son, Jeremiah, and Richard's daughter, Lulu. Where did this kid come from? Did she pop him out before the reception? She didn't say she ever had kids. She never said she had kids. Where the f did this kid come from? So your little man, I didn't even know you had a little man. He's a handsome young fella, though, if I must say so. Thank you. I'm not gonna lie, I, it was just a little shocker. I'm not, there's no... Yeah, no gonna... I'm not one to get in the way of love, but it's kind of weird that you would just leave your son and travel all the way on the other side of the world for a guy that you just met. Do you eventually plan to like move Jeremiah out here? I want to, but I think the yes. hard thing is like Jeremiah is really stable where he's at. He has friends, he has a community, he has all of that. And so to just like uproot him from that and bring him here, and I feel like while as a mother I want that, as a person and as a human being, I feel like is that really the best thing? Nice. What are you talking about? I'm talking about as a human. Out of here, as a human, you're a mom. Ain't nothing Trump that. Tonight's been amazing. I'm so glad that I get a chance to celebrate my new life with my friends, loved ones, and most importantly, my new wife. I need a donut, I like, help me out. Close your eyes, baby. You know I ain't no size six. All that ass. Your twerking days is over, bitch. <laughs> Yo, baby, sneak off to the bathroom. Richard. <laughs> hey, you Richard? Congratulations. You've been served. Richard. Richard. Richard, you can hear me. I see you. Hey, Richard, these are for you. You've been served. My name is Ray Ray. You acknowledge. You acknowledge. Here you go, sir. Yo, what the f I can't believe I'm really getting served in my wedding reception right now. Yo, this is some cold hearted and I know exactly who's behind this. Just doing my job, boss. Just doing my job. There you go. You've been served. No, 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 no. My baby mama, Kathy, is angry that I'm married to someone who's not her. She's trying to ruin my life. Yo, that shit. Notice your failure to appear in court. They result in your immediate arrest. Your failure to appear result in suspension of your occupational and business licenses. If after hearing, the judge finds that you willfully fail to obey the order, you may be in prison for the term not to exceed six months for contempt of court. In the name of the people of the state of New York, Richard J. Duncan, employee of Black Ink Tattoos, 55 Lennox Avenue, come on, sh Let's get out of here. What's up? Bring you down here, Miss Lady. What the is this Miss Fancy Pants doing here? Did she come here to say we're raggedy again? We're supposed to be having a meeting. Who's we? Caesar. Caesar's supposed to be coming down here. Oh, he's on his way? Yes. Oh. Caesar's on his way now, and this mother is gonna go crazy when he find out that the lights are off. This is the last thing I needed. Bye, Sky. Bye, hey, Sky. Bye, y'all. Bye, y'all sitting outside. What's going on? Go in there and watch what happens. It's going on. Why is it dark in here like this? The lights are off. How you doing, kitty cat? Oh, what the is the 125th Street Police doing here today? And why are the lights off? Hey, guys. Hey, girl. Oh, my God. What the is going on? Yo, so I come in the door, right? Yes. This big ass is splattered like this on the gate. 3900 dollars for a light bill? For all that, we gonna have to send water in someone's grandmother's house to steal all her china. What the f can we do? Yo, Caesar don't even know yet, but he said he's on his way. Caesar's coming. 
Where is Teddy at? Once again, I'm going to have to man up and take this into my own hand. All right, so tell him that the fuse is blown. The fuse is blown. We have somebody coming in to take care of it. Unless one of you guys rat us out. Oh my gosh, these bitches are in there. Abort mission! <laughs> What the f is everybody doing outside? These mo just chilling, and nobody's inside working right now. Caesar. Hey, Caesar. Why your faces like that? Why you look depressed? This for you. What is this? What? How the f you run the light bill up to three thousand nine hundred dollars? What the f was y'all doing in here? Where's Ted? Last time I saw Teddy, Tiffin Bay got into a fight and started breaking and Teddy just walked out. What the f is wrong with y'all, yo? This is a crock of bull if you ask me. Not only Ted can't be found, but you got the girls in here fighting like it's WWE. Running a tattoo shop. We got a mother fight club. What's going on down here? Y'all fighting, breaking like, there's no way I should be having a shot meeting in the dark, yo. Hey, have a seat. If y'all fighting in my shop and breaking, I should have heard about it when it happened. So, which of you ladies want to go first? All right, basically, I come in and Young Bay says that I called her a hoe, and out of nowhere, she comes outside and starts pulling my hair. Are you a hoe? No. Exactly. So this wasn't that big of a deal. You a status tattoo. The f y'all sitting outside of on Lennox Avenue fighting for? And they kid come uptown and tell me she gets jumped in 113. And that's my fault. OK. But I just got really defensive at the moment. Nothing warranted anybody putting their hands on me. You leave that for the crackhead, yo. Y'all supposed to be sitting representing Black Ink. From somebody from the outside. I mean, just, I know it's a it's a place that usually people party at and stuff, but like alcohol was a huge portion of why went left. It might be a good step to have it be no alcohol. This isn't a rehab. Thank you for your input. Nikki, shut up. You don't even work here right now. Now, this sugar pole that goes down, yo, in 24 hours. Now look, there's no way our bill should be this high. Y'all ain't making no money like that down here. You know how embarrassing this is? Oh, that's so what I was fuck. telling Teddy, too. Right. Before you hook up your boom boom room, we should have hooked up our tattoo room. The what? We had to paint that first before we. Paint what? Did you see the room in the back yet? The room in the back. He spent like all the money we made now. over there. What? Yeah. What? Yo, what the f is this? He's being shocked about Teddy up. I ain't surprised because I know that this dumb is. Can you FaceTime Teddy so he could be a part of this? Like this is whack, because you entrusted him to protect and serve this shop. How the do you let this mother just do anything he wants in your shop and still gets paid? Like, I, I want to be that. <laughs> I want to be Teddy. Sky. You're absolutely right. So it's going to be change of management. Oh! 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 I, I just, oh! I turned into an owl. I'm like, yes, yes. She's about to tell us who the manager is. Going forward, Teddy ain't in charge no more. He ain't used to running a shop, especially not no all-girl shop. Me, I'm too masculine for that. Be screaming at you, doing all type of so, at the end of the day... All right, hold on, let me get my together. Let me breathe real quick. I'm gonna have Duchess get this shot back into shape. Excuse me? This just said mother Duchess Christina Lattimore, the bitch from the soap propers, is now the manager? I've really been in here sweating my heart with these bitches I don't even know. I am 
Hayden, I might flatten both Caesar and Duchess tires. But that's it. All out of love, they got AAA. She already has a female shop. She gonna get y'all a tip-top shake. This is bull I'm pretty sure Duchess doesn't like me because she tried to stop me from working at Black Ink before. So how is that gonna work with her running the shop? This is First course of action. Tiffany, you're fired. <laughs> Bye, bitch. <laughs> Not enough Carolina to get some respect. In a job, I've never once been treated seriously as an artist. The only thing people care about is who I've slept with. I'm here with my kick ass portfolio to shove it in their faces. What the f is Donna doing here? What brings you here? Hello, hello. What the f are you doing in North Carolina, Donna? I thought we left your ass in Harlem. The only thing she brings is drama and So I'll get straight to it. I built my portfolio and flew down here to show you. I told Donna to work on her portfolio weeks ago. Did she really fly all the way down here to show this as work? Your shading is not accurate. Your lettering. What's on my lettering? Your still ain't spaced out correctly. Okay, either. so go Those up to letters don't page. match. None of that stuff is even. Just as I expected, Duchess is ripping my portfolio apart. She's just like, let me tear this bitch down just because I can't. And then also, why did y'all throw my stuff away? What stuff are you talking about? My tattoo supplies. Why were your tattoo your supplies be in the shop? Because they were. Bitch, please get a grip on your life. You come down here, you're basically begging for a f job. Now you want to accuse me of throwing away your tattoo equipment? What the f is this girl's problem? I have to go rebuy new things like that. Is that? Up. Are you Man, coming for a job up. interview? Or Yo, I just came to show y'all my portfolio. I'm not coming here asking for a job. Why do I need to see your portfolio? Just because you harass me and my. Bitch, does not mean that you're gonna get hired. You did a terrible job, bitch. It's still trash. Give me my portfolio. At the end of the day, if you want to have a conversation with me. Hold on. How you raising your voice in somebody else's establishment? Nah, you are tripping now. I'm trying to have a conversation and y'all don't. Donna, get out. You bugging out. I have a tattoo to do. If you want to be, exit my show. I will talk to you about business. You said you wanted to be. I'll talk to you about business. But you want to talk about personal. I didn't throw away your stuff. See, said to clean out up. Them girls came and asked me, what is this? I said, I don't know who it is. If I don't know who it is, funny throw that, that away. Wow, for once in her life, that just told the truth. It's a miracle. But I still want to beat the brakes off that bitch. Don't touch me. Don't touch. Don't touch. Don't touch. You know my shit? You ask for security. Ask for her. Get the out. Ain't nobody asking you to come here. Get the out. No, I'm not going anywhere. I should have fired that a long time ago. She's a waste of a bad weed. Y'all all sad. Y'all all sad. I don't care. But don't throw my Let me see your ring. I'm glad you finally found it. Fuck it. The out. I'm a, it's okay, Duchess. You gotta come back to Harlem. Steven ass. Worried about somebody throwing away Chinatown tattoo supplies. What? This bitch is so stupid. Get a real friend, you hoe. I don't know who the Donna thinks she is. Trying to be disrespectful, dragging her trashy ass all through here. This bitch is out of control. This bitch is so wack. This is not the day to do that, though. Now I'm on the sidewalk. You knew she wasn't gonna hire you when you came down. I didn't so why come here to get hired. Then why would you bring your portfolio down here? You're not gonna like disrespect like her like that. I got that. I don't That's need what her. you're not I don't gonna do.
None of these bitches gonna touch me. Hey, young man. What's up, bro? How are you? Man, you kitty. And look at number two. <laughs> look at y'all showing up all together. Talk about an entrance. Season Kitty over here looking like Hov and Beyonce before they got on the elevator. You know what I'm saying? Like that old fake fancy, like a power couple and So what's up, Seas? Where you coming from? My house. Oh, yeah. Uh -huh. Where you coming from, number two? Seas house? <laughs> <laughs> yo, what are y'all trying to say, yo? I heard you single and ready to mingle. Hey. What are you talking about? That's I, what I heard, I too. Lord Birdie told me. What Birdie told you, you that? Know, What it is. He got this little mother cat nipping next to him, smelling like pee. Cats smell like pee to me. And they suck out baby's breath. She's the devil. And I need him to see a bad bitch sitting next to me. To my right. Poof. Sit right here, friend. Looking like an angel. Allison, you guys. You already know what Teddy Young Bay, Kevin, Allison, Kit, Allison, Caesar. You already know who Allison is because y'all went on a date the other day. Oops. Oh my God. Was that supposed to be a secret? Because I know y'all seeing a lot of each other. If I finish this drink, I might be all over you. Finish your drink. Y'all was over at the house. I saw y'all in my binoculars. What? And you, you doing a lot of. Oh! Yo, what? What? Yo, what the guy? You my game up, and you gonna get me killed tonight? My, my apologies. Sorry, not sorry. What is up with this out? Did Sky have to announce it in front of everybody? Of course she did, because she's a messy hoe. All I'm saying is there's a lot of going around the table. And from what I hear about Kit, there's a lot of <laughs> <laughs> What? If but I I'm going to be the best at it. I could tell. I knew she was going to do that. OK, Suzanne. Right, she's going to be like, I'm going to be the best <laughs> well, like this. Or, like, she's going to get a scholarship. Oh. As you all know, we're all under one umbrella. We are all a part of the Black Ink family. Who the f does Kit think she is? Like, or better yet, who the f does Caesar think she is? He ain't even let Duchess speak for him like this. So, Caesar, do you have an announcement for us? Yo, good looking, Kit. Nah, man, yeah, I need yeah. that little announcement. You can sit down now. I brought all you motherfuckers together let y'all know, as a family, as we go forward, I'm really starting to think about expanding. Expanding where? Are you trying to take over New York? Not New York, the country. I'm looking to open up another shop outside New York. There's no better time than now with 113 back open with a bunch of talented artists. 125th is making a whole lot of mother money. I figured I got the blueprint to expand this black ink to the next level. It's time to become a mother mogul. Expansion is key right now. But there's certain things that gotta be addressed. Yesterday I asked Kit to go over some brand new unification lessons for y'all, and y'all motherfuckers got twisted. Cause I heard Sky got up and left. She taught us how to pour wine and answer phones, my nigga. Been known how to answer the phone. How many people been coming through there? The point is, I want all my shops to feel the same. And that's Kit's job to make one consistent brand. Was it get anywhere? We gotta start getting some order in these motherfuckers shop. I can't be everywhere. Y'all motherfuckers supposed to respect her like it's me. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Oh, listen, man, what the f is that supposed to be? I'm not supposed to respect her like it's you. What no. are you trying to say right now? She's a young like, no, no, stop! I'm... Shut up! Cause he's looking at me! Yeah. What are you saying right now? That we have to respect her like it's you. No. And you just met her. No. Exactly! No. Shut up! You, you both are acting immature. Like, with well, all due respect, bro, you and I got our own relationship. You my b big brother, and you my boss, and I respect you both ways. And we had this conversation. I said this was gonna happen. What happened? I said, this bitch was gonna get some of your little Jamaican and at the end of the day, like, you're a mini duchess. Get the out of here. Like, Absolutely I'm not a not. Get right. She's not no little duchess. Ooh. She's my employee. That's it. I'm done. I've had it. Evidently, this
this bitch kid got him by his nutsack. I only got him by the ear a little bit, and he might be deaf in that ear. So at the end of the day, I'm tired of being disrespected, because every time I'm talking to this he do not listen. Hey, you're... Don't go nowhere. Don't tell me what to do. Get your Where the is you going? I'm done. I don't respect this I don't deserve this I'm going to finish this shot. Don't leave. Don't tell me what to do. Oh, ma'am, ma'am, okay. ma'am. I'm done with Black Ink. If you feel like the brand ambassador deserves more respect than the people that have held you down, whatever. Oh. You see, I quit. Wait till y'all see this Angela Newman and Donna Lombardi, roommates, sort of. <laughs> Lombardi needed a place to stay. Angela said she could stay with her for a while. A while turned into months. Not paying bills or rent, nothing. She can't pay rent? I don't know what she could do. Oh my so God. I'm telling her, listen, you have to leave. Angela said that Donna Lombardi apparently has issues with walls and windows. I just want my place back so I can live nice and clean again. Damn, Donna. Like you went crazy in this little lady's apartment. Moments later, I was Snapchatting with a guy named Caesar. Look at this face. <laughs> Don is not paying rent, and it's kind of messed up. And so now I'm involved in it. So if you could get a message to Donna. I don't know that girl, but I can get a number of my brand ambassador kitty. is not funny. I am humiliated that this fake ass news story aired on television to millions of people. How the f did this get here? You know how it got there? That bitch is crazy and she's obsessed with me. She's a liar. Like, that is fake news. So did you break the window? Yeah, I broke the window. <laughs> she tried to lock me out of my own place. So yes, I broke my own window. <laughs> So this bitch lied about everything on Help Me at Howard except breaking the window to get into her own room. This story might sound strange coming from a normal person, but Donna's a cuckoo bird. So is it over with? Yeah. I'm done with that bitch, and as far as I'm concerned, we've never seen each other again, unless it's to beat her ass. I got a tattoo client to try to hustle up some money. I got to get the into my own so. She said, help me house. I Brother think Donna lying. God bless. I can't hear y'all. <laughs> Is that Donna's roommate? Does my old hoe of a roommate think that she can just try and blast me on help me, Howard, and then roll up to my place to work with her skanky ass daughter? No. Donna, what's up, bitch? Yo, this lady right here, I bet you she wishing Howard could help her ass out right now. What happened? Your, your girl owed me $2,500. She never paid rent. Was with me for a year and a half. She my crib or she broke my door. They in my bathroom. in my bathroom. Like that? Yes, yeah, like that. She <laughs> my crib up. You're laughing. It ain't a joke, yo, for real. Any mess that Donna's involved in, I usually blame her because she's a messy bitch. But this old bitch definitely got Donna beat. Come on, bitch. You gonna get the fuck out of here right about now. Oh, like, man, yo. I will see that bitch in court. You f my house up, bitch. I know you live, bitch. You know that. Look who's out of jail. Who is just talking about you? Hello. Who are you? Melody. Who's Melody? Melody. Melody? Yes. So who's Miss Melody, your new friend? I'm a new employee. No employee. I didn't hire her. I ain't said her come in here. I'm sorry. If you ain't get a call from Caesar, then you shouldn't have pulled up. Like, I don't know what the f is going on here, but I'm still the boss. Here goes Cees. I'm the boss. I'm the boss. I'm the boss. You always like, he's like the f the black lady that works at the welfare office. You can't give them no power because it goes to that little peanut head of his. Melanie? Melanie. I know my cut. Melanie, I'm the boss, and I like to hire people myself, you feel me? And I don't really know you, so I'm sorry about that, but you're gonna have to go. This is the United States of Black Ink, and Caesar is the dictator, president, and every other thing. Are you seriously firing me right now? 
for you to be working here, I had to hire you. You're not hired right now. I don't know what he was thinking. Maybe another time when I'm not irate, then me you can sit down and talk. I don't know what kind of business you're running, but I can guarantee I'm the best artist that's walked in that door. Are you kidding me? You know who the don't walk through these doors? Whatever. I just feel so disrespected, and I'm just like, who the are you? Do you know who the I am? Like, you guys are all clowns, and you're going to fire me, the one decent person you have in your shop? This is bull. It's a beautiful day to go buy some art. Yeah, I was about to say, what the f is we doing here? Raw space, this sound like a porno. Yo, listen, fella, if this is a little private song, this is only for us. I'm trying to get in this market. Lately, I've been thinking a lot about my assets and how I can live like those one percenters. So I've decided to put 1% of my money into art. See, what is this? That's abstract art. OK, explain it to me. Abstract is when the artist basically is having an acid trip. And then his dimension is just his own dimension. And then he just paints out what the f you want to paint. What? OK. Yo, C's got to lay off the chronic and work on his reading comprehension. Because whatever book he picked up last week while he was high, I'm pretty sure that they say whatever the he just said. No bull This is kind of dope. I like this. But I would definitely hang that like in my bedroom. You put this piece in your bedroom? Yeah. This is more like a piece that you put in the bedroom or the dining room. I'm tripping. <coughs> my name is El Cesar. <laughs> I want to be fancy like everyone else in the art world. Wee oui, wee. Oui. <laughs> Word. Stop acting like you do this. As the people will say, I am a poser. <laughs> this is nice. I like how the artist is using all different got, like, types of like um, materials, just canvases and. Oh, this is cute. Oh. This kid has got a new look this evening. Mm. Yo, this blonde shit look good on you. Thank you. It's different, dude. You smell different. Look, I know I look damn good, but I didn't come here tonight for compliments. I came here because Caesar invited me, and I want to see what his sorry ass has to say for himself after treating me like this past week. This right here is very nice. Let me see. Little chaotic. Chaotic and crazy. Teddy! Oh, my God! Bring your ass outside, bitch! Bring your ass Clearly, the girl is still pissed off about what she found out the other night. So this cannot be good. Why you sitting there looking stupid? Bring your ass outside. Yo, what the is wrong with you? What are you doing here? What you mean what I'm doing here? You trying to play me? What the are you talking about? You know exactly why I'm here. What? No, the I do not know why you're here right now. The last time I saw you was at the team building trip and we was all kumbaya and So why the is you here now acting like a psycho stalker? What, you got a tracking device on my Stalker, what are you doing here? You wanna f on this bitch, Tati, and that cost me my job. You wanna fire me for no Whatever reason. I do with this don't concern you. We don't you want don't you no you more. Me. I don't give a We don't no want you more. It's the principle. You fire me for no reason. You fire this me. This is the reason you fire you psycho. You think I'm a psycho? Let me show you exactly how much of a psycho crazy bitch I can be. You think I'm a psycho? Yo, why are you by my car? Yo, what the what are you doing to my car? Oh! oh my god! That's a whole gallon! Yeah, bitch! Oh yo, she pulled paid on this car! Oh sh you! Wow! Hell has no fury like a woman scorned, I guess. Bird ass bitch, that's why I got you yellow paint, too, mother. Last night, me and Alex went to dinner because I planned to break up with her. <laughs> Give me a hug. <laughs> it's freezing. Instead, I fed her muscles and wound up swapping again. <laughs> How are you? We hooked up and it was so unexpected. It was so out of left field. People come back. They always do. How was your day today? It was cool. I don't really do too much. I'm tired. I ain't get no sleep. I wonder why. I don't know. Somebody had me up on me. Lucky girl, man. Yeah, she is. So you want to talk to me about something? 
I wanted to talk to you about the undeniable, undeniable attraction that there is going on between you and I. Here we go with this again. Alex, what the are you talking about? I'm not looking to settle down with nobody. I don't want to settle down with nobody. There's no friend involved, but you know what it is. You don't have to be a part of that. Nobody says you have to Teddy if you like Teddy and you want to deal with Teddy. You have to accept what Teddy does. Or what if the same thing that you want, I want? Have you ever thought about that? I don't mind. It'll make it. Uh, it'll make it easier, actually. Always been up front, always tell the truth. She just didn't get it. So now that it came out of your mouth, we can leave it at that. And I can sleep better. See, now you got this crazy look in your eyes. Stop saying that, I'm not crazy. You are crazy. No, I'm not, you're the crazy one. You're the crazy one who acted a certain way and then shifted. I never acted a different type of way. I'm always the same person. You were kinder, you were sweeter, you were nicer. And so we had sex after that. You started getting on my nerves. And I told you that, just like I'm telling you now. When did you tell me that? I've been told you that. No. No. I haven't spoken to you in God knows how long. The last time you texted me, you sent me like a full paragraph text. And I told you, you was bugging the out and stop calling me by my first name because you don't know me well enough to do that. Sharif Homer should have been a little bit more honest. That's it. If you never wanted me to know who you were, you should have never opened up to me and told me. But don't try to retrieve everything back because you're unsure of your feelings. I don't even want to leave it on a bad note between us, but this is how you feel. This is how I feel. Obviously, we're not going to be together. Nothing. There's, I'm just, I'm not gonna, there's nothing to say. There's nothing else to say. I'll see you later. Oh, I left these in the shop now. These are not even mine. Uh oh, pardon me. Thought they was. Hey, y'all. It's your boy, Caesar, Black Ink CEO. If you don't know me, the reason why is you ain't subscribed to VH1 YouTube channel. At the end of the day, you already know. That's the number one channel on YouTube. And if you don't got it, I guess you just watch the number two.